so the box. I wish they would have put like Pegatrix right here instead of um, Drago. It just seems like it's fitting compared to what they did on here. When I do it on here, um, here's the Bakugan itself. It comes with the Bakugores too right there, and there's Dan in the back talking about the app, showing it open and what it includes, and the again the lack of detail like just using a generic drag so they wouldn't have to do behave tricks like this. I guess it saves a little bit of money but I think it's worth it for the price at least. Um yeah so and you do need to know English to open it or to use it. So I'm gonna open it. So here is the Vacuon and honestly I at first didn't really like it. Um, just looking at picture online, but getting it out of the box, it looks pretty sweet right now. Like, like it just looks great in my opinion. Actually, let's see how I can put it back together. If I can close it right, I wish I put this one first. But anyway, here we go. And yes, this is a closed completely, unlike my um, Diamond Dragonoid, which if you watch this, the head stays like this. So yeah, here's the card. So 200 plus, I think it's B power, I'm not sure. Um, and two, I don't know what that is. Here's a closer look at it. So yeah, there's the back of the card. And here are the two back of cores. I don't know what this means, I really don't. So but this is what they look like. And here's what it looks like. That's pretty much it for my unboxing review of Bakugan Battle Planet Pegatrix. Um, I will do some more Bakugan videos, but I still just need to get like, I want to do some battles with them. I just need to get like the, some more of the, um, the Bakugores and some more, uh, I believe these are called gate cards. And then I'll do some battles with them. So yeah, this is, um, that's it. Thanks for watching.